Your email list is what converts your followers into paying customers. It's important to build a relationship with your followers outside of social media. Having their email address will give you direct access to them anytime that you want outside of Facebook or Instagram or Twitter's algorithms. You can contact them anytime that you want with any information that you have. People who are on your email list are much more likely to read your blog, to engage with your content, and to buy from you in the future. So first things first, you need a host for your email list. You can set up a free account with MailChimp if you haven't already. This will give you a place to store all of your emails and send emails from. So how do you get people to subscribe to your list? Start by building a simple landing page. It can be as easy as a name and an email input. This is one of the first ones that I've used. It's really easy to build in MailChimp. So MailChimp will give you the link to that specific page. Then you can include that link in your blog post and your social media. If you wanna learn more about starting a blog or an online business, make sure that you sign up for my blog school email list at infjwoman.com slash blog school. There's a link in the video description. Here are three tips to get people to subscribe to your email list. Number one, promote a weekly newsletter. If people are reading your blog and liking your content, they'll want to know every time you post a new blog post. The best thing that you can do is have a weekly newsletter to tell people every time you post a new blog post or you have a new video or whatever you have going on. So you want to promote a weekly newsletter so that when somebody does find your blog and they want to see all of your content, they know exactly where to go to get all of your content sent directly to them. Number two, promote a freebie. A freebie is anything that's valuable content that's free. This can be a worksheet or a short ebook or any type of helpful hints. How you set it up is you promote a free ebook or worksheet in exchange for somebody's email address. This is the most common way to get people's email addresses and it's actually the most effective as well. Make sure that the content that you're promoting for free is valuable though. That's extremely important. That helps you to build trust. And number three, promote exclusive content. Maybe you only offer some blog posts to people who are on your email list. When people see that, they'll wanna subscribe so that they can read the posts. Your email list will give you direct content to your most engaged audience. It's never too early to start building and growing that list. If you want more advice about starting a blog or an online business, make sure that you check out my blog school playlist. Also, make sure that you subscribe so you never miss a video.